Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and there is two updates in a row, two updates in two days for Microsoft Edge stable version. One of them is very important. Uh, you know that we had a Google Chrome update with um, security flaws, including a zero day that was already exploited in the wild. So that one was really important to fix. Well, now, of course, Edge has the same security updates that have been released. So for security reasons, uh, that is one of the first things you should do. And of course, the other thing that happened is uh, bug fixes. Yesterday, uh, the day after there was the security flaws, there was a series of bug fixes. People were complaining of different issues with Microsoft Edge stable version. So that also is fixed. Uh, so if you had issues, if you had problems, check it out. And even if you don't have any problems, do check out the updates to make sure you're at the latest version for the security updates. It also contains that severe security flaw that is uh, zero day for uh, that already is exploited in the wild. The same one that we had in uh, Google Chrome because the basics of the browser are Chromium. So to update, go to the upper right corner and the three dots, go into help and feedback, make sure that you check about Microsoft Edge and make sure that you have the latest version. Even if you don't use Edge, Sometimes links can actually open Edge in a, um, you know, unusually. Um, we don't have it if you have your defaults right, but it could happen that a uh, link in an email or in an app wants to open Edge instead of opening the uh, favorite browser that you have. So today, February 18th, 2022, you should be at 98.0.1108.56. So this is the latest security update and bug fixing update. Two days in a row of bug fixes and security fixes for Microsoft Edge uh, in Windows 10 and Windows 11. If you enjoy your videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.